Before we get into this video guys, if you are looking for some high quality controllers and controller accessories, I will leave a link down in the description. Go check out Cinch Gaming and use Rich at checkout for a nice little discount. What's up guys and welcome to a little bit of a different type of review today. Today we're going to be taking a look at Man of the Match, Kabai Arrow, Joe Hart. What is he doing in that? We don't need Joe Hart, guys. Let's get him out of there. We need Man of the Match, Willie Caballero, the Penalty King, the Capital One Cup Savior. Guys, if for some reason you were living under a rock and weren't able to catch that Capital One Cup final, Caballero really wasn't testing the first 90 minutes, but he did make a crucial save from a header in extra time. And then when we went to penalties, guys, he made three saves leading Manchester City to their first silverware of the year and in this review guys you will see that I actually um, own goal myself after being up a ton of goals really um, to get myself two penalties I was able to get into two penalties out of the five games that I played with Caballero by own goaling myself and in the five games guys he also had two clean sheets and a 1.20 goals against average. This is before I own gold myself, but we'll get into that a little bit later. Let's go ahead and take a look at his face card stats, guys. 83 diving, 74 handling, 69 kicking, 85 reflexes, 49 speed, and 84 positioning. He also has a three-star weak foot, one-star skill moves. He is six foot one and does have a traditional save technique. In five games, guys, like I said, this guy actually played very, very well, and I was super happy with him. And as you guys will see in the video, like I said earlier, I did own goal myself into penalties, in which he did lead me to two penalty victories out of the two penalties that I was in. I actually got uh, three chances pretty much to go to penalties, um, but the kid ended up scoring in like the last last minute of extra time so I did not get to do three penalties but as you guys will see I will go over his pros and cons and then we will see some of the penalties that he was able to save uh, as you guys know penalties are hard um, but let's just see what Caballero's made of so now guys we're going to take a look at some Caballero uh, in-game uh, in highlights as well as the penalties as you guys can see right there three own goals of myself to get me to these penalties um, and as you guys can see right there, didn't save that one. Um, they're very hard to save, guys. You kind of have to get them perfect, but I ended up saving that one. What a save from Caballero. This is, like I said, guys, so much fun. Um, it's kind of hard, like I said, though, to save. You pretty much have to time it and guess right every time right there. Probably could have saved that one, but I did not. But I will end up saving one to give us the victory, guys. I think it's right here. Nope, maybe the next one. This one right here, guys, he's going to hit it right up the middle. I'm going to save it. All I need is a goal to win these penalties, and Gail Clichy is going to put it home, guys. Thank you to Caballero for making two saves. It's going to get me that win as well. Um, and you'll see, guys, some highlights where he comes out and is able to make some nice saves like that. Um, but let's take a look at his pros and cons as well. We're going to get into another penalties probably right after this. But his pros that I have are his reflexes, his positioning, and, of course, his penalties. Um, this guy is very good at reacting to the ball. Um, he's always in the right spot. And guys, penalties, obviously, he knows what he's doing. He's penalty king. As you guys can see again there, three own goals <laughs> to get me two penalties. So this is one of my clean sheet games um, where Caballero, the very first one, Higuain, I think it is, hits it wide. Um, so Caballero must have just scared him. I'm not sure. He must have watched Capital One Cup game. Um, but after that, Caballero doesn't save any, or I don't save any. It's kind of hard, guys. Like I said, you got to time it perfectly right. Didn't do it. But I still did get the win from that one miss. I was able to convert all of my chances. Um, but like I said, guys, his reflexes, his positioning, and his penalties. Guys, Caballero is very, very good in that. And I had a ton of fun playing with him. His reflexes are great because he can just react very well. He's always in the right spot, it seems, during the games. He's able to make crucial saves like that right there. Um, and guys, penalties, like I said, if you guys ever in a penalty, I think you're going to want this guy in net just because of what he's done <laughs> in the in the game and in real life. Uh, so yeah, definitely pick up this card if you guys can just to give him a whirl and see how you feel about him. Um, but let's take a look at his cons real quick, guys. Obviously, Caballero is only 80 overall, so he's not a perfect card by any means. And Joe Hart probably is a better selection if you do not like color in your team. Um, 
Cons is handling. Uh, he has a 74 handling rating, so sometimes so, you know he won't catch the ball. It'll kind of shoot off to the side like that right there. Um, so he has handling issues every once in a while, but they're not uh, too bad. And then another minor one is his kicking stat, or it kind of plays into fa uh, factor with his throwing stat of 69. Um, so you can't really kick it that far with him and create counterattack with him, but that's really not that big of a deal. Um, but this is now going to go ahead, guys, and take me into the overall uh, summary of the card. And I believe that out of a 10 scale rating, this man of the match, Willie Caballero card, guys, deserves an 8.7 out of 10, which is a very nice rating uh, for a goalkeeper. His pros and cons are listed, as well as the games played, the clean sheets, the goals against average, and his save percentage of 83%, uh, which is actually very, very impressive. Like I said, guys... This guy was known, uh, is known for what he did in the Capital One Cup yesterday, guys. And this is why he has this Man of the Match card. I had a ton of fun playing with this card. I am not going to lie. Um, so, guys, up next, we're going to be trying to get out a Sub versus Me series uh, video today. I played another kid last night, another subscriber last night. Um, so you guys will be able to see how that went. And then after that, guys, I'm going to try to crank out uh, my Paolo Maldini review, and then we'll have Legend uh, Mathouse, Lothar Mathouse after that, and that will pretty much be it for our Legends. Um, so yeah, guys, I also need to get out another uh, the Champions League giveaway video out, so I will do that. So I'm trying my best, guys. I am on spring break right now, actually, so I'll be able to get more videos out than I would like to. Um, so yeah, guys, so thank you for checking out this video. As always, guys, feedback is appreciated. Leave a like, a subscription, and until next time, guys, I will talk to you later.